My favorite thing about indigo dyeing is I'm always surprised by it. Initially, when we went into lockdown, I was seeing all of these posts of the shortage of personal protective equipment. It, I sort of took it as this like call to arms and I became obsessed with making masks. First, we picked a fabric that we knew would take the dye really, really well. So we only work with natural fibers when we work with natural dyes. Then I added just little clothespins to make the actual pattern on the fabric. So these masks are three layers sewn together. I do an interlining of a non-woven interfacing, and then I'm also doing a filter pocket. I personally have gone through many different iterations and emotions about these masks and making them. Um, and uh, I don't know, I mean, just know that they're, they're made with love and um, we're just trying to help. <laughs> know that by supporting the crucible, by purchasing these masks, you're protecting yourselves. You're doing it in a healthy and in a natural way. You're protecting others as well. Um, and you're supporting our community. The Crucible for me is just such a cool resource. It's been well known for being a, an incubator of creativity. And I think that it's really important to support places like this and to support this place in particular, the Crucible. It's a long-standing Bay Area gem.